Well, you guys have been speaking and you've come up with your top Indian players of the season so far, so take it away. Well, we just about <laughs> came up with it after a little bit of a squibble. Oh, we're better around Ding Dong. We're better, better around Ding Dong about this, but that is what football's about. It, it is. is a game of opinion. So, Ash, you start with the goalkeeper and we can argue from there. We <laughs> went with the goalkeeper. That was probably the big sticking point. Okay. Um, I've, got, I've managed to get my own way because I was oh. being diva-ish and stamping my feet. <laughs> you threw a diva strop, didn't you, Oh, he did, you, by the way, he did, yeah. <laughs> so we got Sir Bratter Paul in. Um, I think he just kept the clean sheet. He was a captain, a bit of a leader, but Gary wanted somebody else. Arminda from Kolkata in the game against North East United gets parachuted into this game. No one's quite sure, and he pulls off some superb saves. No, they do not win the game, and that's possibly why Sir Bratter Paul comes out on top because he has the clean sheet. But I thought... He was exceptional on the night, pulled off some world-class saves. OK, what about defensively then? Well, the back four, we've, we've gone with Wadu at right back. We actually agreed on that one. Yeah, we did. Uh, we yeah, did, I think, yeah. Uh, opposing figure, tough boy, obviously, playing, you know, playing well, consistently. Um, had a couple of results as well, so he, he gets the nod at right back. When he controls his game, excellent. Just has moments when it's not controlled and you just think, ah and treads a fine line, but uh, I think he's well deserving of a place on the team. So the, the other centre-halves in there was Anas at centre-halves sure. from Delhi Dynamos, didn't do quite well. Jingham, we knew he was going to have a, a decent tournament because we see mm. him be impressive last season for Kerala Blasters. And the left-back was Fanai, the other sticky point really, because uh, Fanai left-back from Mumbai has done really well, but Gary was at the other game that he fancied someone else. I liked <laughs> Robin Gurung at okay. North East United. He has impressed. He works tirelessly down that left side. He takes defence into attack. And then I watch him throw himself in front of challenges and shots and be aggressive. He's not the tallest player, but he's up there competing in the air with anybody that comes into his area. So in the end, it goes to Fanai, but I thought Robin needed a mention at the very least. We'll watch out for him this week then, eh? Please Let's do. take a look at the midfield now, Ash. Yeah, the midfield, uh, we agreed on, on two. Uh, Gabby Fernandez on the right-hand side for Mumbai has been quite impressive. More mm. with his work rate than anything else. So he's gone in there. Toy Singh, again, midfield from Chennai. You know, his work rate has spoke for itself. He's been up and down. I think sure. he's covered almost every blade of grass, if yeah. you like. And then Gary got his own way in midfield because <laughs> I went for someone else. Yeah, I decided that I would be a diva, just okay. like Ash, for, at least for a moment. And Eugene in Pune. I think once he starts to get his feel for how things mm. are in ISL, he starts, his vision's good, he's got good energy, he works hard, and I think, for me, alongside or around Zakora, he will only learn, and he's, you can see already that he's beginning to absorb a lot of what the uh, African players brought to ISL. Interesting, and then what about up front? Was this a sticking point as well? No, we're pretty good oh, with this. Good. Yeah, we're pretty cool. You know, we have our moments. <laughs> you had we have our moments. moments when we disagree, but they pass. <laughs> but you kissed him made did, up We've got to remember one. that uh, from Chennai FC, Jayesh liked him on that wide left. But then we couldn't ignore the obvious. Sunil Chetri has to be forefront and centre of that attacking midfield option. And then we liked Rafi from Kerala. Both of us agreed that, yeah. you know, I thought he scored an excellent goal just the other evening, and Chetri is Chetri. He headlined our show, so uh, big surprise he's in there. Yeah, so we've got quite a lot in there. We've got a good work rate. We've got some goals, obviously, with Chetri and Rafi. Rafi being a local boy as well from Kerala was nice to see. So mm. it's, uh, it's not a bad team. 